are bringing back the boss. The Boss 302, the ultimate performance Mustang from the late 60s lives again. More awesome than ever and street legal. We're rebuilding a legend. Boss is the biggest and the baddest. It always has been. This project is bringing it back and bringing it back better and faster than ever. This new 2012 Boss, in the same spirit of its heralded predecessor, was developed on Ford Proving Grounds and racetracks across America by a special hand-picked Mustang team. The Boss 302 was developed by a group of people that are extremely enthusiastic, love everything about Mustang. Everybody's working together to build the baddest Mustang that we've ever built. The Boss is probably the most well-known Mustang in Mustang history. The original Boss 302 made its mark on the racing world when the legendary Parnelli Jones drove it to victory after victory, establishing the prominence of Ford Racing and the Boss 302 Mustang as the car to beat. Parnelli Jones is, in my opinion, the greatest race car driver of all time. Parnelli is synonymous with Boss 302, so we definitely wanted to get his opinion on what it means to him for us to bring the Boss 302 back. Yeah, I think this whole bottom section should be dark, too. It's great to see that we're carrying on the tradition of the Boss, and uh, uh, I think we should have done this a long time ago. Forty years later, here we are with another Boss, and I'm telling you, it's going to be a sensational car, in my opinion. Mustang lovers can take pride in knowing that the new Boss 302 has stood the test at world-class racing venues like Laguna and Daytona against some tough competition. The saying that racing improves the breed holds true in the Boss 302. When you talk about a boss to a guy that's had one before, and he knows it's all about handling, he's going to have the handling, he's going to have the stance. But most importantly, he'll know that his car is going to be proven out on the racetrack, and professional racers are going to go out and make sure that the boss name is where it belongs, which is in the winner's circle. We were able to let all our engineers who loved the Mustang and loved driving put every little piece they wanted in the car. What we are experiencing here is hands-on development taking place at the track that is going to benefit the production of a car. Today's Boss 302, like the original, is built on the Ford goal to produce the best all-around performing Mustang ever. A car bred on the racetrack, factory built for the street. We ended up with just a fantastic vehicle that's a ton of fun to drive. It absolutely is over the top. You can't put it in words. It's just, it's a boss. <laughs>